welcome to our channel, Informed Investing. My name is Don Lawrence, CEO of STA Research, our platform is StockTargetAdvisor.com. I am a financial analyst and a trader. Uh, today, again, we're bringing you the uh, top analyst uh, ratings we do uh, uh, today and every day. Uh, so today we're tracking a total of 378 uh, analyst reports. Um, at the moment, uh, more is coming in as we speak. Uh, we're just going to go through here uh, the top 10 um, uh, analyst ratings that we think are uh, sort of uh, quite important here. Uh, first of all, we have uh, Apple um, here at FT Research. We are raising the target on that to 160, uh, sorry, to from from 160 to 170, and we're maintaining the uh, buy rating on the, the stock there. Uh, we've got Airbnb uh, coming out here. We've got Truist Securities maintaining their whole rating, and they are cutting the target by $30 to 160 from 190. Then we've got uh, Air Canada, Canada's main airline there, CIBC World Markets are lowering the target to 30 from 35 and maintaining the outperform rating. We have uh, seven analyst reports come in for uh, Santa Incorporated. One of the notable uh, uh, analyst ratings uh, coming through is uh, JP Morgan have cut the target to uh, 25 from 32. We have uh, Bank of America getting upgraded, um, the, the, uh, the target upgraded to $43 uh, by Keith Bruett Woods. And Sienna uh, Corporation is coming through with uh, 10 analyst ratings, um, of which uh, the uh, main significant one is Citigroup, who upgraded the stock to uh, um, a buy from a hold and raise the target to uh, 67 from 65. One of the big uh, meme stops coming, th meme stocks, sorry, coming through is um, GameStop. Uh, Jeffries has raised the target today to 110 and they're maintaining the hold rating. We got Lululemon or Lululemon, uh, however you like to pronounce that. We got nine analyst uh, ratings uh, coming on on that, the uh, Canadian company of which uh, we believe Deutsche Bank is the most notable one, uh, raising the target uh, 427 from 423, and they are also keeping the buy rating. Now we got uh, Calum coming in um, on Tesla. Tesla's down quite considerably today on news that uh, Elon Musk is saying he might qu quite possibly lay off 10% uh, of his workforce, concerned about the economic environment and so forth. And uh, so the count is keeping their uh, market perform rating, but they're chopping that target right down to 700 from 790. So quite a, a significant move there. And last but not least, we got uh, Snowflake here. This is one of my uh, favorite uh, uh, companies here at the moment. Um, and uh, Raymond James is initiating it with a uh, outperform rating and a 184 target. Now, Snowflake is one of the companies that tends to be a bit more controversial um, obviously, since it's IPO, a lot of people um, are sort of wary of the valuation using traditional metrics. Um, they see it as quite overvalued. Um, really, it sort of takes a really different lens to look at this company and, and really place value on it. Um, it's one of the fastest growing um, uh, stocks on the market. So, and it's got some other attributes that make the valuation, especially at, at, at the levels of trading quite, uh, quite uh, attractive anyways guys that's the end of our uh, top analyst ratings um if you would like to have um all analyst ratings from american canadian uk europe indian and some other uh, countries uh, um analyst ratings for, their, for those uh, countries stocks uh, sign up for our premium uh, service it's only five bucks a month you get those analyst ratings delivered to your uh, inbox twice a day in pre-market and midday if you have any questions, guys, feel free to email us at admin at stocktargetadvisor.com or leave uh, some uh, questions in the uh, uh, com or sorry, your questions in the uh, comment uh, section. We'll get back to you. Thanks very much for tuning in, in guys, to Informed Investing. Appreciate it. Have yourself a great weekend and uh, happy trading. Cheers.